Good morning, ladies and gentlemen. Check out the shiny epoxy floor undercoat. We have, though, evidence of my entry footprint. So it's still tacky, and it has to be because the second coat has to go down after 12 hours but before 24 otherwise you have to key the um, key the primer which I don't want to do so I think it looks fantastic certainly looks the part doesn't it it's shiny um, but I can't walk on it to put the second coat on so we have to address that situation and I have a cunning plan so I've got my mucky old trainers on for obvious reasons. Up framing and I think if I draw around the foot like so and do the same on the other one, I could have got a sharpie that actually had some bleeding ink in it. load like a bet. Let's try this blue one. Okay. I'm not going to be winning any but like film and television awards for this. This one am I? There we go. I'll have to swap hands. So part one of my cunning plan. I think you can see where I'm going with this, can't you? So we've got some screws here. We'll pop the screws through there. I've drawn a little grid out. I didn't cut these insole bits out, if you like, because I need some way of attaching it to my feet. Because we are making some spike shoes, of course. Um, so I thought we'll leave that and we can whack a bit of string through there. And wrap it round the old shoe. So fingers crossed that works. I think it will do. So I'm going to drive all these screws in, and we'll, well, we'll try them out for size. Oh, well, there we go. They feel kind of weird. Let's get them on. So you can see these spikes poking out the bottom. They feel like kind of quite sharp. I wonder if I should. I don't know, wear them down a little bit. I'm not sure. I might just hit it on the sander just to take them sharp, sharp points off because I think that might crack the concrete. I'm not sure. Yeah, I just knocked the tips of the screws off. When I stood on it, I felt them dig into the, into the concrete on the floor. So we'll just knock them tips off and, fingers crossed, this should be a functioning spike shoe. Well... Kind of. I think I need to work on the laces. They kind of dangle off the feet a little bit, which is no good. I think we've cracked it. What do you reckon? I think it's good enough. Could be better, but good enough. So, let's have a walk on and see what happens. Oh, yeah. There we go. Leaves little to no impact. That one's twisting slightly. Might be awkward when I'm panicking and trying to roll as quick as possible. Maybe I'll just put another piece of string around the front or an elastic band. Now there's an idea. Let's go and find an elastic band. Haha! <laughs> Works a treat. I sound a little bit like the horse off Steptoe and Son. And it's kind of awkward to walk and film at the same time. 
but elastic bands have done the trick. Hey, look at them specials from Clark's. Aren't they scruffy boots before anyone says it? Well, you wouldn't wear your Sunday best for laying down a resin floor, would you? Well, I'm going to go for it, folks. I'm going to go for it. So let's get let's get in to the tin. Sky blue. Beautiful sky blue. So I need to put that in there, mix it and lay it. So the next thing you're going to see on this brief video today on a Sunday is the first coat down. Wish me luck. Well, the spike shoes worked an absolute treat. So I think I'll just chuck them in the car and we'll open the door and have a look at the result. There you can see is the evidence. So obviously the light is off because I've got to lock up and go home. But there she blows. I think she's a beautiful finish. Another coat to go on, it's really, really difficult to roll and uh, some little bits of feathered edge concrete pulled up along that edge there which pissed me off and it's kind of ruined the finish a little bit but c'est la vie it's only the cask wash area I figured we'll make sure that doesn't happen in front of the boil kit make sure there's no loose debris I thought it was adhered down hard enough but obviously not but uh, just one negative all the rest are positives we managed to get enough to do the floor but not this section here the paint covers a little less because it's uh, it's thicker because it's a high build surface but I'm pleased with that and uh, well I'll be keen to see what it looks like with the second coat on top so we'll see you on the next vlog I guess folks cheers see ya to her missus we obviously want to send the boy to school tomorrow because we don't want him stuck here all day. So in order to get to class, he's got to carry out one of these bulky stripping strips. Remember, stick it right up your nose and then in your mouth. Other way Is that around. the way? Oh, other way around. I do apologise. A little bit complicated for you, isn't it, Gemma? <laughs> Just a little bit. On a Sunday evening after a couple of bottles of Stella, eh, hey, sweetheart? A little yeah, difficult to uh, figure out. Hello, Patrick. Oh yeah, and uh, Reginald, to celebrate St Paddy's Day, he's uh, changed his name to Podrick. Haven't you, Reggie? Hold on. High five. Good boy, Paddy. Nice work, Paddy. High five. Oh, he's a good high five of this boy. This bit. Well, it's nice to see they've made it as simple as possible. Stick it up your snout, wiggle it about, see if you've got any corona gonna come out. Hey? Poet and he didn't know it. Can we see in this light? There's no COVID in here. I don't have anything funny to say. I don't say anything at all. Okay. Oh, I said okay. I suppose I've ruined it now. That's as good as it gets, isn't it, Podrig? Peering around the corner like fucking creeping Jesus. Honestly, who do you think you are? Where's Chance? We've not seen him on video for a long time, have we, Reginald? <whistles> Chance! Come and see what Reggie's got! That might bring him down. What do you think, Reg? Reg? Where's Chance? <whistles> Chance! Here he comes. Uh oh. Here he is, little old timer. How you doing, pal? You've been missed on the vlog, Chance. Is that it then? It's just a brief cameo. Sit. You gonna sit down, boy? Sit. Chance. Sit. Are you going deaf? Good boy, Reg. Chance, sit. Chance, sit. Sit. You can tell he really doesn't want to. Oh, good boy. Is he sat down, Reggie? 
He did, didn't he? You lunatics. Oh, God, I don't even know where I'm going to put this in a vlog. Maybe it's going to go on the end of today's because it was pretty brief. So I think that's enough dogging around for now. Isn't it, Fat Chance? Say bye. Hey, Reg. See ya. Not as.